Cool. Um, then kind of, you know, second core model of B2C, we are not going to spend much time on this course. And the reason for that uh, is, oh, well, you'll actually see why. B2C companies hire way fewer salespeople. Now you might ask why, and a good way to think about it is when you're making a B2B sale, that might be $10,000 um, for one sale. Whereas a B2C sale might be just only, you know, five bucks. So the dollar value per sale is much higher with B2B. So it makes much more sense to spend on a salesperson's salary to go after that. Then finally with marketplaces, um, you know, this is one where it gets a little bit interesting. You start to see blended dynamics and the way they make money is a little bit different. Essentially, you know, a marketplace is a business model that connects potential buyers and sellers all within one platform to help buy, sell, exchange products or services. And when you start to break down the types of marketplaces in themselves, you've kind of got, you know, again, B2B marketplaces where it's businesses transacting with businesses like offload, B2C, like if I'm going to book a hotel on booking.com, that's a marketplace. And then C2C, like maybe, you know, uh, I'm selling some jeans on Gumtree and then someone else in my neighborhood buys them. So you can start to see how, you know, the marketing and sales approach there becomes a little bit different. And in terms of how marketplaces make money, the four common types you see there are subscriptions, where you know a company might pay a certain amount per month to sell on a platform, a listing fee, where it's like a cost per uh, selling, um, commission, uh, where it's like you know on the percentage of the sale or a dollar value per sale, and then finally featured listing, 